Samantha, I really appreciate the help. But you and I have very different ideas about what's sexy. This is about the blowjob, isn't it? What? One little blowjob, and I'm a hooker with no taste. This isn't about the blowjob, this is about the book cover. I don't feel comfortable being on a shelf next to a biography of Eleanor Roosevelt with my breasts hanging out. What is the problem? I've seen you at cocktail parties wearing not much else. Nuh-uh, not lately you haven't. And you know why? Because it's time for ladies my age to cover it up. We can't get away with the same stuff we used to. <laughs> Meaning blowjobs. Oh, Jesus, again with the blowjobs. What is your problem? Oh. I don't have a problem. You have a problem. I have marabou-covered breasts. That is my only problem. I'm not blind. I saw that look in your eye in my office. What look? That judgmental look. That wasn't judgment. That was shock. I thought we were having lunch. Are you telling me you have no judgment about me and the World Wide Express guy? No judgment. But, but I do have a question. Will this relationship be priority overnight or next day delivery? Oh, come on, Samantha, lighten up, remember? If I walked in on you giving a blowjob to a worldwide express guy, you would never walk in on me because that is something I would never do. There. And I cannot believe that you would judge me after everything that we've been through. S Samantha, where are you going? I'm going to splash some water on my face and then I'm going home. And I will not be judged by you or society. I will wear whatever and blow whomever I want as long as I can breathe and kneel.